What's up? Welcome back for some more Animal Crossing. Today we are focusing on the fish of the July update. Fish are a little bit more difficult to catch, I find. Um, I try my best, but I also go through the list of like what is actually new in July, if you haven't seen it already. But yeah, definitely checking out the new fish and the new bugs are definitely a great pastime while we wait for the new update, which is tomorrow. I'm so excited. I hope that you are too. I will be covering it, of course. But if you like this video, hit that like button. Let's me know that you want to see more videos like this. And if you're new here, hit the subscribe button because I do post every single day. And that's it for me. I'll see you in the video. So, of course, I can't pronounce this person's name, but this is their creator code if you want to check them out. I think their outfits are incredibly cute. I'm not sure if it fits my skin tone the best, but like, that's okay. So today we're going to be looking for the fishies. Of course, it is July, a whole new month. So we are doing the fish and the bugs while we wait for the new update. I'm really excited for it. I, I literally like, I'm so sad that I won't be here for the first half of the day. So I can't get the video up as fast as possible, but it will be probably my regular time, which is around four to around anywhere from four to six um, Atlantic time. I'm not sure if that's the correct time. Ooh, the puffer fish. He thought he would be a tougher fish. Oh my God, that's so cool. Whoa, is that, is that a shark? Is there, okay, I think there's like one new shark in the whole month. I don't know if this is him though. Oh my god, that was so fast. Okay, no, it's not. I think this is a sucker fish. I thought it was a shark. Oh wait, I get it. Sucker. Haha, ha, it's a sucker fish. <laughs> so funny. I've never I've never seen that fish. So that is a new fish for me. But I'll I also have only gone shark fishing once. I'm only gonna go for fish that are weird looking, A. Or if they are medium or large. So, oh, sorry, small fishies are not for me today because I know that all the new ones are like really large. I'm gonna get rid of also some of these fences so it's easier for me to move. I find I always get trapped. Come on, large fishies, where are you? Really, what I should do, yeah, is like get some vanilla clams and like actually bait some fish. I'm really bad for that. I don't know. Maybe my maybe my thought process is, is that if I get a regular fish off of the vanilla clams, I'm just like wasting my time. So I'd rather just like run around and like spawn the fish. Where's my rare fish? Maybe I will do that. Honestly, they get a little. You need some uh, vanilla clams over here. Some vanilla clams and their help. Although I don't have a lot of uh, space, so we're gonna have to make make do with what we got here. My favorite flavor of clam. Ha 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 ha. I love how Animal Crossing is just known for their absolutely terrible puns. Like, absolutely terrible. I bet you some dads just created this game and was like, we're only here for the puns. The whole point of the game is to catch fish and they're all gonna be puns. Let me catch this guy. I think this is a, a medium-sized fish. So we're gonna catch it. There's also this option. Oh, that's just a squeedy. A squeedy, squeedy. I will let it go because I'm not here for you. A catch and release type of day unless you're a really super rare fish then it's a catch so there's actually one fish in particular that i am looking for um i think it just became available this month it's that really big round circle fish and he has a whole other type of shadow to him so i know like we would know if we're gonna catch him let's do it let's craft some fish bait some fish bait all right so i'm just gonna use all this fish bait and then if i don't end up finding my giant colossal of a man that's okay. I'll find him some other day. I believe. I believe. Hey, here's a medium-sized fish. Or maybe this is a large fish. Hello. That was so fast. Some new fish. Aw, oh, no. But it is a big boy, so we're getting close. I can smell it. I wonder if there's like a difference between like being on the rock. Okay, so yes, I'm looking for the ocean sunfish. It's super rare. It has a fin. It's on the sea from 4 a.m. to 9 p.m. So most of the day. There's no reason why I cannot find this guy. Let me scatter some. It's okay. Hey, that's a pretty big fish. Kind of giving me sea bass vibes. So hoping that's not it. But the Napoleon fish, which does not have a fin, is also pretty large of a shadow. So hopefully I get the Napoleon fish or the ocean fish. I would love that. I knew it. Sea bass vibes. It's like I can tell. It's sad that I used my food for that. I wonder if I if I scatter more food, 
on this guy will turn into a fin and a hole. Hey, that's a big guy. And he's not giving me sea bass vibes. Maybe this is the big guy we've been waiting for. Hello. Napoleon bitch. No! My plans have been ruined by the sea bass. Isn't that the worst? Like, how come sea bass have been available literally the whole year? Can they like not? Do they ever migrate away? It's a serious question. I'm not a sea bass expert, so I have no idea. Well, dang, I guess we're just sticking with our puffer fish. Puffer fish is the only new fish. Um, I will go down the list though for you guys if you want to know all of the fish. So the fish that become catchable in July are the sweet fish, which have a medium shadow. The Napoleon fish, which have a huge shadow. The puffer fish, which has a medium shadow. The blue marlin, which has a huge shadow, but I think I've caught him before. And then the ocean sunfish, which is a finned, I think, finned shadow. Um, everything else I think is, is pretty much regular. So I think the one fish that we did get that was new was the puffer fish. So that's cool. Um, yeah, definitely go check out these new fish for yourself. If you're like super interested in fishing, I know that I love fishing. I'm so like, I'm good at it, but it does take a time. You know what I mean? And also there's so many sea bass, but yeah, that's going to be it for me. I hope that you enjoyed. Tomorrow is of course the new update. So definitely keep an eye out for that. I hope that you're ready and excited to see what it has to bring. I'm really excited to catch everything, meet Pascal for at least for me the first time ever. Um, and yeah, that's going to be it for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.